I'm Jerry Franzer for the Pan American. We're here at the Basketball Showdown where the UTPA All-Star Team will be playing against the Texas Legends Cowboy Stars. Uh, can you tell me what this whole event benefits? It's for scholarships for student athletes. So every dollar that we raise today will be for that. We've got uh, Spa Glass helped put it together and they helped arrange it. And then we've got some other sponsors to bring it together. So we're hoping to raise a lot of money for scholarships. How did you get the Cowboys to come down here to play us? Well, uh, we, we've got a, a Renee Capistrano from Spa Glass. They are uh, the, the major construction company for the university. They're doing a $42 million fine arts center project. We were talking about doing a fundraising event, uh, getting them to get a little more involved with athletics. And so he had actually talked about uh, they do this type of event at the local high schools through his charity. So, you know, one thing led to another, and we started talking about it, and I thought about bringing in community leaders and the former Bronx players, and uh, so we're pretty excited about having that here. So I was wondering, are you guys here just for the Cowboys, or are you here cheering on your TPA? Uh, both. The, more the Cowboys, though. Cowboys? Yeah, many of the Cowboys. More Cowboys. How do you think the game's going to go tonight? Do you think the Cowboys are going to smash us? Or? Yeah, massacre. Massacre? Yep. <laughs> All right, thank you, guys. John Braxton playing for the UTPA All-Stars, as well as one of the assistant coaches, Tim Anderson. All right, let's turn up here. Hey, Hey, uh, sir, hey, you're in the game for about five minutes. Go ahead and turn over and get this two shots. How are you doing, man? Oh, uh, you're not. So how does it feel coming down to South Texas from the Dallas area? Uh, it's a lot of fun. We look forward to this trip every year. and We have Cowboys Nation down here. The best Cowboys fans in all of America are down here in the RGV. So. Uh, it was a lot of fun. We enjoyed playing the game as well. Well, I think it turned out fantastic. We had a bunch of people from the Valley that was out here. The Cowboys performed well. All the individuals that participated in the game played, performed well. Legends Promotion did a great job. UT Pan Am did a great job. What else can you ask for? That's right. Can we see your Super Bowl ring? Can you see my Super Bowl ring? <laughs> you can see me, but here we go. Give me your shoulder here. Let's get us both in here. Super Bowl ring. I want to make sure it looks good. That's why we have it beside her. Okay. Now, you're from a UTPA player. Um, how does it feel being able to come back and play here again? Oh, it's great. Um, I love I love being in the gym. You know, Chris and, and the athletic department have invited all of us back. And uh, I mean, it's it's a great it's a great family atmosphere, and, and I can't complain. So it's a great it's a great experience. Now you guys got to play against the Cowboy players. How was that since they're professional players? Well, it, it was a great experience. You could tell that they're professional athletes. Uh, you know, basketball and football are two different things, but yet and still you can still see that they're you know very athletic. So it was a great experience also to get out there with those guys. Now you got to play with the Cowboys today. How did that feel? Uh, you know, it was just another game. Uh, I had a good time. No, it was fun. Uh, it was a good opportunity. I didn't expect it. I thought I was just going to be in here working, and uh, it turned out they needed a sub. So, so it was a fun experience. I'm glad I glad I got to do it. This event turned out to be a great success. We did lose to the Cowboys. The ending score was 75 to 57, but it was overall an entertaining and fun, good event. Um, now, both teams, the UTPA All Stars and the Cowboys, had great sportsmanship. The one player that stood out from the Cowboys today was number five, Jesse Hawley, who's a wide receiver. He was scoring so many threes. He was shooting his threes away from the three-point line. Now, we also had our athletic director, Chris King, um, our president, Dr. Nelson, who were also playing a tough game. They were sweating, running back and forth across the court, something you usually do not see. For the Pan American, I'm Drew Francis.